Hey guys, Mike the Vike here, back with yet another Rust base tours. The first one we're taking a look at is B4M's base. I really like the design. I, would, I don't want to say it's modern, but like, I think they've done some things to counter the twig stuff, which I think is worth looking at. Of course, if you're interested in seeing more base tour videos on the channel, don't forget to leave a like on the video, that helps me a lot. Oh! Sorry. Mike! Mike, no! Oh, I'm finally meeting Snipe and Soup. This is such a good day. So, I have a question. Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, so, what have you done that's been- Ah! Jesus! No! I will TP- I'll TP you back. That's ridiculous. It's my fault. Oh, crap! Oh, no! I'm sorry! That was not on purpose! What have you done that is incredibly unique in this base design? Incredibly unique in this base design? Yes. Um, yeah. check this out. Here, come down here, buddy. Let's go downstairs. Let's go down here. I got it, man. Whee! See, oh, see, oh I'm not again! No! 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 <laughs> come on! No! Don't you dare. What the heck? You have a basic both ways? You're crazy. Yeah, like, this, yeah. So this is one of the better like areas for defending right here, because you can come up if they breach right here. Ah, oh, yeah, so you trap really them. Helpful. It's kind of it's kind of like an extra double wall, and if yeah, you come all the way around, it goes 100% all the way around the base. You can see we own we basically own everything that's around here. Okay, so they told me to take a quick view inside, so I'll go ahead and do that. We got doors. Doors. Oh, there's a guy here with me. Doors. More doors. We got a ladder hatch thing. Oh, another ladder hatch thing. Those are fun. Oh, we got a nice uh, trap. Greeting. Oh, that's a really good idea. If they uh, blow this up, they get instantly killed. And then even more traps. And, you know, I'm not going to spoil the whole thing, but you get the idea. This is... Very nice setup. Oh, this looks like the loot room. So honestly, the main thing I really like about the base is how they've like used tons and tons of traps everywhere. And the barricades help a lot too. But the traps, I'm I'm really excited that they added that to the game. I think it made a huge difference, and I don't know if even the developers like anticipated how important these things are now. Okay, so the next base we're looking at is Charms and Juicerino's boat. Now, I'm going to say Stimpy probably started the trend for boat bases, because I've seen a few of these now, but I like this one because it's like just classic design. Is this like the hugest base? How is this going to actually hold up to a raid? All of the questions, I don't think it's going to do very well at all. This is 100% roleplay. He, he doesn't even have window bars. I'm not sure what he's thinking. Oh. Oh, this is actually sick. This is actually, he actually made it like a legitimate ship. He's got his quote-unquote cannons. I, I'm not sure how well that's gonna work. He even went full-on roleplay and added a little wheel thing uh, for the captain of the ship. How is this base held up in this wipe? Have you actually survived? Um, n no. Uh, well, um, as you can see, it was, it was raided. It, uh, we got raided on Sunday or something like that. Um, but yeah, Aww. as you can see, you come in here, it's pretty cool, we got some dead bodies, you know, oh, we keep nice. them there for the, uh, just for the, uh, aroma and whatnot. Ah, uh, yes. Uh, over here, this was our easy-to-get-to loot, as you can see, we, they, they left some, uh, some juice, maybe a, a Ooh, torch or two. That's very nice. And, uh, over here, this is our dungeon, we keep our, our slaves in here, um... And, and, you know, they can write, they can write, uh, their stuff while they're, while we're fighting pirates and whatnot. Over here, this is the, uh, the dining room, you know, the captain, they sit, they sit right here and, you know, they can, they can eat their grub with the, with the landlubbers. Uh, what's with not having any lights anywhere? Is this like one of those low-end boats or what? What, 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 can you repeat that question? You've got no lights in your captain's quarters. What kind of captain doesn't have lights? Yeah, no, no, that is not the captain's quarters. That or is not, not even quarters, quarters, son. Like, just, this is the ah, meeting room. Do you know how many ah, expensive people would be in that room and you don't have... No, 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 none of that. This is the captain's quarters right here. You know. And no lights. Chill here. Okay. The fidget spinner is up here. 
only some can wield the fidget spinner. You might not be able to to wield it. Oh. Oh. How, how'd you do that? Hacking! How do you like the base, Mike? Out of uh, t 1 to 10, how would you like the base? I like it a lot. I'll Is give it, it like a... Rep? I will give it a plus rep good trader. Thank you. Plus rep good trader. Oh, Here, one second, you, one yeah. second. Oh, Wait. That's all, that's all I wanted tonight. <laughs> <laughs> I have an abuse. I, I had a dream when I heard that. Incoming. <laughs> oh, oh my god. It's wipe day, boys. Not admin abuse. <laughs> Oh! 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 <laughs> Give me a second, Mike. Don't reload that shotgun. All right, here, here. <laughs> ah. Oh my God! Copyright. Perhaps I could turn up my gain on my microphone. Oh crap! Calm <laughs> down! That's so loud! I'm gonna kill myself! <laughs> Not today! <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so this next one is made by a guy named like Roarer or something, or maybe his name is Rory, I don't know. But, this is a very weird design, and it, I would say it's specifically to counter the twig update. And that's why I'm going to showcase it real quick here. So he's decided to put basically a whole bunch of floor frames everywhere, and uh, I'm going to ask him how effective this is. Firstly, how do we pronounce your name? It's error backwards and then forwards, but just call me error. Okay, so uh, does this actually work? Does your wall frame right. thing work? The floor frames. Well, it works because you're forced to get to the top with ladders only, and the turrets see you at that point. But yeah, you have to raid the tower and jump on or ladder up. Why go to the trouble of doing that if they can still place ladders, you know? Like, is it... Do you just hate, like... They could still get to the top. Well, yeah, but if they get to the top, there's still turrets here. But, brother... If they place the twig things up here, they would get to the roof and also get shot by the trap, by the turrets. So it's like, it'd be the same result. Yeah, you're right. It doesn't really matter. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> Wait, what, hey, what is the frame? Oh god. <laughs> They're burning their loot! Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, although maybe not the best design in terms of, you know, will it actually work? I think it's interesting execution. Hello? Uh, hello Us people. lefty. Here, dude. We're about to wipe. Here, here, take some things. Oh, we're about to wipe? Thousand empty four nines. Oh, only gives me one. That's lame. There you go. Here, let's, let's make this a little shit. bit spicy. You know. <laughs> oh my god. Yo, Mike. Yes. When uh, so when we wipe, uh, did, I thought I heard that the uh, cap was gonna change to like 200 instead of uh, 250. Um, no. Is that right or no? No. Oh. Oh wow, this is still up. What? And they still have ammo? Oh my god, I did this for the update video, and they're still basically unused. That's insane. How has nobody killed this? Someone raided my this thing. Like, what a way. Oh, God, they still work. They're still loaded, most of them. Okay, so that's going to be the end of base tours this week. Sorry for the delay on the video getting up. I actually have two base tours ready to go. Um, so they're just going to come up pretty quickly. Got a good amount of interviews in there. I think you guys enjoy the interviews a lot. So I try to do lots of those. This is a course recorded on my modded Rust server, it's called Viking Republic. If you want to join, there's details uh, down below in the description. Anyways, that's all I got for today. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.